we're going to go right to the game of the week. Paragool, Green County, Paragool, excuse me, Green County Tech at Paragool. Great game, sellout crowd. Take a look at this. I'm Dave Grimm for the basketball show. I'm in Paragool for what is arguably the biggest rivalry in Northeast Arkansas basketball. It's Green County Tech versus Paragool. Now, Tech got a huge victory last night right here over the number one team in the state, the Forest City Mustangs. But this is Tech versus Paragool, and anything can happen. In the first quarter, Wes Livingston comes flying in for the baseline lay-in. The Eagles looking good early, holding on to a slim lead. Rams hanging tough in this one. Here's a shot from Justin Roberts on the baseline. Paragould down by just three. Later on, though, it's Zach Mitchell with the steal and the fast break lay-in, and Tech goes on to roll to a 30-point win, 55-25. to I'm Dave Grimm for The Basketball Show. Wow. How about, how about what that? What a crowd. What a great atmosphere. Don't get any better than that. Uh, let's, let's take a look at some of these highlights. Green County Tech hosting Four City. In the third quarter, Elisa Diggs dishing it to Amy Fletcher. Amy making the deep jump shot, and the Lady Eagles go up by 25 points. Later, more from Amy down low with a nice finish. Green County Tech up by 27. Then Miranda Lamb pitching in, drains the deep two-pointer, and the Lady Eagles roll to a 60-32 win. From the same conference, Nettleton got a fiery coach trying to get his team pumped up for the big game. Third quarter action, win out in front. Lenora Bryant up the baseline for the lay-in. Win goes up by 10 points. Later, Nettleton fights back into it. Andy Watson with the basket and the foul, and the Lady Raiders down by just two points. Then how about Hannah Chambers firing one off from three-point range, and the Lady Raiders go on to win a close one, 33-31. to 31. <coughs> Great highlights. You know, and that's what you want, Coach. Uh, I wish I, when I played, they had the highlights of me back in the day. You know, the thing that, uh, okay, yeah, Ernie, I got you on that. <laughs> I hear that. Let's get to the highlights, and let's take a look at this. At Green County Tech, the Eagles' nest was rocking in the first quarter. Here's Zach Mitchell making a shot for Green County Tech. Later, the Mustangs taking the lead on a shot from Gavin Glanton. That puts Forest City up by two. But it's all Tech late. How about Trace Davis knocking down this three? Green County Tech was taking care of business tonight, winning 63-51 over the number one ranked Forest City Mustangs. It doesn't get any better than this huge crosstown rivalry, Valley View, hosting the West Side Warriors. First quarter action, West Side getting off to a good start. It's Brett Huffstedler for a three-pointer. The Warriors take a six-point lead. Later, more from West Side. Ethan Clark going to dial in from long distance, and the Warriors go up by eight. Valley View not going down easily, though. On the break, it's Taylor Lindley with the bucket, but the Blazers come back, come up short tonight. The Warriors upset the Valley View Blazers 70-66. to 66. Yeah, very good. Very good highlights. Good job.